Well, we were out there Friday, but when you go to the State Fair of Texas, you may notice that security kind of looks a little bit different. Fair organizers have found a pretty creative way to help keep guests safe. Our Brooke Rogers shows you. Can I help you? Stationed in booths throughout the State Fair, you? you'll see members of the State Fair safety team. And if they look like guest relations, that's part of the job description. I'm asked, where are the restrooms? How do I find big techs? Where are the food stands at? But all 75 team members are actually retired police officers. Kenny Soule is a former DPD lieutenant who served 31 years on the force. Like I said, I've been retired two and a half years. We've got some officers here that retired 20 years ago, and they just enjoy what they do. The safety team was born after the 2019 fair when the security team decided to re-examine its allocation of security resources. Sworn police officers used to man the booths. A, a police officer uh, affixed to a stand really only has an operational area of right around that stand. And we thought that there would be a better way to utilize that resource in a more policing role, and then we could replace them with another asset. Now the sworn officers can roam in and outside of the fairgrounds and handle situations if they arise. We want to be good stewards with the public's resources, right? And they're, all, they're in these better roles where they're walking around within geographic zones. The security team members can easily access the officers via radio if necessary. And in addition to being another layer of safety for the fair, it also gives back to retirees like Seoul. As far as the retired, working with retirees, you know, just a chance to work and see officers that I haven't saw in years, it's been wonderful. It really has. Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News. Sounds like a lot of winners on all fronts.